A man can permanently alter the DNA of a woman who mothers his children. This is wild, you need to choose your partners carefully. It's called fetal microchimerism, and it's this principle that when our little humans are in their involuntary incarceration, their stem cells, which are 50% the father's, can actually free transfer between the mother and the baby. The evidence shows that those cells can stay with the mother even after the baby is born and can cause epigenetic changes to her DNA. What's even crazier though is if you have an older sibling, then their cells would have been transferred to the mother and now being transferred down to you, adding a whole new layer to a family bond. Almost as a thank you to the mother, these fetal stem cells have been shown to protect the mom against some cancers. Sadly, there is a catch though that they can also increase the risk of autoimmune conditions. This could also partially explain why some mothers describe their child with a new partner looks like their ex, although so could cheating. Either way, it's comforting knowing that if we've lost a mother or a child, a real or life part of them is still with us. Did you get your